Hi guys, welcome to our channel and today we are going to be spending a day in a 70 million dollar mansion. So come along with us. One in a million, one in a million, one in a million, one in a million. We just woke up and we're in a bed that's bigger than our apartment. <laughs> I'm actually not joking about that. I wish I was. And yes, we sleep together because why would you not? You can fit 12 people in here. And even though this has 12 other bedrooms, I was a bit scared last night. Yeah, because you feel like when they're in the other bedroom, they're like a city away. It's like she lives in like Westwood and I live in like downtown. It's it's so far. So today we're going to take you around. There's a lot to do in this house and we're going to have a jam-packed filled day of activities. Sports. We actually have to work because we have jobs. <laughs> we're both real estate investors, but we have the whole house for the day. So we are going to get some work done, but also break it up and do some activities as if we lived in a $70 million house. Because yeah. we do. We're gonna let you guys know if this is an experience that we like and if we want to purchase the $70 million home or if we would prefer our apartment for $1,200 a month. <laughs> Just kidding, we don't pay that. I wish we did. <laughs> We're gonna let you guys know, and we would also love to hear from you guys. Is this something that you guys would wanna live in as well? And what would you do if you lived here? Come along with us. go to the dentist. What, for what? Just get my six month cleaning and I also wanna get a whitening. Do you have your um... insurance still? Yeah. Yeah. You do? Until yeah. you're 26? Yeah. Oh, nice. Yeah. One more month. Go go in and get her done because that is expensive, let me tell you. I know, it's gonna expire. Okay guys, so we are getting ready for the day as if we're gonna see someone today. We're really not, we're just gonna be at the house. But you gotta look cute while you're working. Just a little, I know, we do look cute while we work every day. Yeah. And if you're in this kind of house, I feel like we would be suited and booted. Yeah, you gotta look the part. So we actually bought a $5,000 suit just for this house. <laughs> Just kidding, we didn't. But it, it, we do look like we're worth more than $5,000 in the suit we're gonna put on. So follow us to see that. This house also has a little place for you guys to get a pedicure and a manicure. We booked an appointment, little best friend's day. My toes actually look really good though. <laughs> I know, my toes are already done. <laughs> we don't have a masseuse. So am I rubbing you? Or you rub it. Yeah, so we, I rock, think, paper, scissors. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I lost. Oh, you're so sorry. No, I'm just kidding. You lost. <laughs> okay. All right. <laughs> Thank you for coming. <laughs> oh, that's actually pretty nice. Do you, you like strong or? Yeah. Okay, so before we start work every single day, of course, we get a massage <laughs> because we live in a $70 million mansion. So we start our day with a nice little massage. Little <laughs> I'm sorry, all you booked was one minute. What the 60 hell was seconds. that? <laughs> that was not worth 60 it. seconds, like your ex-boyfriend? <laughs> <laughs> no, I didn't say Oh, he was 60 seconds. He was so quick. <laughs> A minute to three minutes. Okay, three minutes. Get so in. we're gonna put Kinsey over oh, putting me in here? Okay. Yeah. A few moments later. Do you feel like you lost fat? Your I brain, feel so much skinnier your now. Your brain is on fire. <laughs> wow. What does cryo do? Cryo basically like freezes your whole body. It like shocks your body. So it helps stimulate, I don't know, blood flow and all that stuff. So now that I was your masseuse, will you be my hairstylist? Okay. <laughs> now we are at the hair station of our $70 million suite. So I have limited tools, so you can either get a braid or a ponytail. <laughs> I will take the braid. Really? Yes. Like a French braid? Just a little braid. Just a little braid. Okay. That I will take out. <laughs> what do you want to do today in the house? <laughs> well, let's make some coffee. We have to get to work, so we're gonna work. But let's play around for now. Okay, ta-da. And this is what you get at a $70 million mansion. That's a $70 million braid right there. And the girl is priceless. <laughs> I did have one of these in my house in Puerto Rico, but I actually didn't really love it. <laughs> it. It's so complicated and you have to like do this whole rinse application and it sometimes it takes so long and I'm like, 
This is why some of this super high end stuff for me, I just don't even f with because look at, we got a little Keurig over here. We, we brought our own Keurig <laughs> just in case they didn't have a coffee machine when we were staying here for the day. <laughs> Coffee machine. Well, hey, our I didn't know how to work that coffee machine, so <laughs> I've tried before. And it's like 10 it's minutes later, enough. I'm hangry, I need my coffee, yeah. and I'm mad, and the $10,000 machine made me really mad. I for sure need some creamer in my coffee. Jess drinks hers black. I know, right? <laughs> Let's Maybe. see who can make coffee faster. <gasps> I think it's a rip. Oh. <laughs> Easy. Oh. Oh, it needs to be scaling. I told you, every like 50 what? cups of coffee needs to descale. What does that descale mean? Oh, oh, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine. You're already gonna lose, I'm sorry. You almost knocked me out. <laughs> <laughs> what the hell happened to all the water? Oh my god. <gasps> I'm gonna win. <laughs> How do you work this shit? Oh my god. You guys, this is not okay. I think I might win this round. I think they should have left us here alone in this house. <laughs> Two thousand years later. Look at this little spitter. <laughs> what a little pebble! Okay, nice. Nice. What did you work at Starbucks? Actually, my first job was coffee bean and tea leaf when I was 16 to 18. Wow. All right, so my coffee is wow. finally done. So I'm actually not a fan of Keurig anymore because I lost and it took me 15 minutes to make a coffee. Whose looks better? Well, whose has less calories? Yours. Yeah, so. But <laughs> we are now going to have our coffee and go get our workout on and then get to work. So our normal yeah. daily routine, but a lot different in this house. Yeah. Five forty-five a.m. We really wanted. We are early risers, and we wanted to catch the sunrise because we have a crazy tennis court, and we're gonna do some laps, and then we're gonna lift a little bit, and then I wish they had tennis rackets, but we couldn't find any because I would have loved to play tennis this morning. Um, but then after that, we will get to work. Yeah, let's go do some laps. Though. She's in her Air Forces, and I also forgot tennis shoes, so. This will be good for my feet to get a little rough and tough. Do you feel grounded? Shut up! <laughs> what are you saying? It's your move, but the pain is. Sweating, my spray tan is gonna come off. And now we're gonna go shower, of course, in the craziest shower I've ever seen and get ready for the day because now we're gonna start work. Well, this is the last thing we have to apply about the permit, so we should be able to continue with the get back to work tomorrow. But So we are three hours into work and sometimes Jess and I need a little bit of space so she's working at the other side of the street. <laughs> this is the only problem about a house like this. This table is way too big. Like I don't, how does it work like this? I don't have, even have this many friends. <laughs> <laughs> Who has a dinner party with 50 people like this? This is crazy. Anyway, but we've been working really, really hard today. <laughs> we didn't actually start vlogging because we needed to focus for the first three hours. Things are happening, so let's get back to work, but we'll keep you guys there for a little bit. But we're gonna drive by tomorrow, and we're gonna check it out if you can issue the permits. I also am a thousand square, but if we're gonna buy the lot for 1.6 million just the land, we're gonna buy it tomorrow. If you can guarantee the permits with it, we're gonna buy it tomorrow. No, Jess wants to make an offer. I'm just kind of like, I'm not sure what Okay. 
Okay guys, so we're not mad at each other anymore, so we're gonna work a little bit closer. But I, I do need you to approve that landscaping design because we have to submit it today. So okay. I, let me show you the two different options. Okay. So we could do the DG on the ground for the, the drought. So this is option Or the grass. But does he actually one. just... But we have to find these plants tomorrow because we're gonna submit to the city. Okay. But the DG is gonna be cheaper and also the city's gonna I like this quicker. better because mm -hmm. it's, it's drought resistant. I think I'm just gonna submit for the DG. I think this minimalistic vibe really matches yeah. our interior. We're gonna save on cost. We only have 10 grand for landscape. 10 grand? <laughs> yeah. You think we're gonna do it with a 10 grand? <laughs> Girl, we're on a budget. You, do, you really think we're gonna do it within $10,000? The market's shifting. I We are... <laughs> We're fitting in the budget. I'm gonna be out there all <laughs> planting all those plants myself. <laughs> Okay guys, so we just had a busy day of work. We actually had a really busy day and we are uh, looking into a development in West Hollywood, which I'm very excited about. So our work day went well. I'm actually kind of tired from all the steps we've done in this house because it's massive. But movie night! Yeah, now we're gonna have a movie night and I'm gonna make some popcorn. What a wifey, making me some popcorn. And we brought some butter. Turn it off. Well, it's hot. Okay, you guys, I know what you were thinking in the last slide. Why did they not put butter on their popcorn? And not to fear. Oh, not to fear. <laughs> Without she brought this to the house and we spent the night and she didn't put it in the fridge. So unfortunately, Kenzie doesn't want the butter. But we did order some pizza. Kenzie, are you having peace? <laughs> I was hungry. We did have lunch. So we had we the lunch in this vlog. Should we bowl first or movie night first? I think we Let's should bowl. Let's bowl and then whoever wins gets to pick a movie. <gasps> Let's go. Yeah. But in the end, really, she actually got two strikes. So, yeah, that that I one thing was broken. In case you're wondering. <laughs> so the movie I picked is Titanic. So let's go watch the Titanic. Not Jack. Oh, I know. I know. I'm going to die. I mean, there's been like boys or something. This is me, 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 me. like we're cuddling on the couch watching the Titanic. Actually, I was just thinking, like, why didn't we invite anyone over? <laughs> we really need to spend Ooh, everything. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Don't touch me. <laughs> the fact that they gave us this house for ourselves for the day is baffling, so we're gonna make sure we put it all back together perfectly. We don't want Like, we were never be. here. We were never eating popcorn on your couch. <laughs> well, what do they expect? All right, guys, thank you so much for joining us today. A life 
a day in the life of a 70 million dollar home. We had a lot of fun. What did you think, Kim? That was so fun. And I just feel like, I don't know, if you live in a place like this, like every day would be so fun. Yeah. But also we felt a little bit like we would get lost a lot. Yeah. Like it feels less cozy and we're really about cozy. So we love it. I just think it's a bachelor, more of a bachelor pack. It would, it's more of a bachelor. You want to have a party, you want to show we off. We should have friends over. Yeah. <laughs> we chose to do this alone. <laughs> but we were also nervous. I mean, we, don't we were watching fun. a movie in a huge theater, and it's just like just the two of us. <laughs> just the two of us. We can make it if we try. Just the two but we love each other so much, and we are gonna be doing these every week. Yeah, we are. That's our goal because we wanted to do. We are real estate investors, so we obviously have all these huge developments and work with a bunch of people because we're also real estate agents. But we didn't want to just do a simple tour of the property because that's not as fun. So we, we wanted, wanted you guys to come along with us and do some bowling, watch a movie, do some fun activities because it's not really fun when you're just walking around the house and showing it. It's fun when you're actually enjoying it. And I hope you guys really enjoyed this. Let us know in the comments below what kind of houses you guys want us to do and what activities would you have done a day in the $70 million mansion. So like, comment, subscribe, and hit the bell notification to stay up to date on all of our next videos.